So I'm going to start down here on the bottom of the rudder. I routed out and uh, ground down the area where there was a hairline, literally a hairline crack, maybe five inches long total. Um, the post looks good. It doesn't look like there was any intrusion around the post. Looks solid. Uh, as I've been drilling, what I've found is that uh, the steel, mild steel, goes out a full 10 inches. Uh, there appears to be surface rust on the steel plate when I core down into it, into the uh, filler, but the plate itself seems quite solid. Uh, looking at the welds, the welds look quite nice and clean. Uh, here's one of the tabs, it's about two inches long from the post. And then uh, here's another uh, spot where you can see weld. Um, the only spot that was a bit odd was in one of the lightning holes. Um, someone had uh, filled that hole with a piece of three quarter inch ply and that was damp to the touch. Uh, here's the uppermost hole that I've drilled. It's about two feet up. It's a little more than midway above and you can see the lightning hole and uh, the steel looks like it's in quite good shape. There are a number of spots where I can see that there's been water working its way up. You can see, for example, this little crack and it's led its way up into the rudder. Uh, like I say, even midway up, this plywood was damp to the touch, but uh, the steel around it looks quite good. There's a piece of the steel uh, on the outer edge of that plate. 